were just these little tiny nubs. They all weighed not even half of a pound. A dog had had puppies and the dog died in a cesarean. They were hours old and they were very weak. I sleep with them next to my bed and I wake up every couple of hours so to feed them and care for them. Around four and a half weeks, they started exhibiting signs of the flu. What's going on with you, my precious girl? We had them tested and be tested positive for distemper. Distemper is a very, very deadly virus. Pretty much everyone told me that they were gonna die and that they really had little to no chance. I was devastated. I had been with these babies since the day they were born and I felt I owed it to them to be with them until they were ready to go. While there's no treatment for distemper, the only thing that you can really do is just boost their immune system in every way that you possibly can. That was the course that I chose to take. I used all kinds of vitamins and supplements. I don't know why they're not eating this one. It's the same thing. Throughout the entire thing, they were so snuggly and cuddly and so ready for affection. You look so skinny. I don't think I ate or slept for three weeks. I didn't really leave my house. I was with the puppies the entire time. We got them retested on January 21st and they tested negative for distemper, which is somewhat of a miracle. You would never in a million years look at them and know that they were sick, ever. They're fat and strappy. When you see them now, how beautiful and strong and healthy they are, I think not giving up was the way to go in this case. It's Frenchies versus Dryer Balls. They're just adorable, sweet, affectionate, happy, bouncy French Bulldog puppy. And I've literally bottle fed and tube fed hundreds of puppies. But these particular puppies to have been given a death sentence, I literally could not be more grateful and happy. Like, comment, and subscribe.